Welcome back to Guns and Gear Network, everyone. Appreciate you tuning in today. Wanted to bring you a little update video. I had done a couple videos recently about mounting some equipment to the top of your roof rack on my, uh, on particular my FJ Cruiser bug out vehicle project. And I wanted to, somebody had asked me to do a video of everything attached, and that's what I'm doing today. To kind of show you a little bit of what it did and how the mounting brackets, and I'll put in the section below the, um, videos if you hadn't found those of how to make these brackets but i'm gonna kind of it's gonna be a little shaky because i've got it off the tripod but if you look this right here is the mounting brackets and if you also notice i've went in here and added a cable and a lock right here and so forth uh, this is my high lift jack I've recently uh, took it all apart and painted everything keep uh, and if you get if you keep it outside like this uh, any length of time you need to keep it painted and old so that's what I've done here and and I'll give you some close-ups here in a few minutes I'll kind of try getting up there and give you some close-ups and if you look on this side I've added my axe and my shovel and I've painted it to match the high lift jack and um, part of the reason I did that is to protect it from the sun. And this is actually a wood handle. And this right here, this paint will keep it protected. But there's the mounting brackets. And the lighting isn't the best out here, guys, because I'm losing daylight, but I apologize. But uh, I'm going to give you a little better view here of what everything looks like. And if you notice, here I drilled a hole in the rear end of the axe. I didn't want to drill it in the center because it'll probably weaken it but back here it wouldn't matter and then i just simply ran one of these uh gun locks through it i'm gonna climb up here and kind of give you guys a better look now one thing i did because these quick fist i think they're excellent as far as the quality and everything i was still a little concerned when you've got stuff on top of your roof here with uh, you know wind and things like that or if one of these would uh, you know lose um, the grip and come undone or something these are pretty dangerous to come flying off your car and go through somebody's windshield especially this three and a half pound axe very dangerous so what I did was I went ahead and added one of these uh, heavy duty rubber um, kind of like bungee cords that um, uh, kind of holds it all together wrapped around the back side here but if you look those are the mounting brackets that I made and then of course there's where i drilled and i just simply ran it through the uh, handle here uh just to the only thing that's gonna do is keep an honest thief from messing with it and if these things that's another attachment point if these things would break loose you at least have this here too but that that cable lock's not all the greatest um so anyway this right here kind of keeps it all together and keeps it uh, potentially from rattling but i thought it turned out pretty nice with everything and i'll take you around to the other side and show you how that's done All right, guys, so if you look, this is the uh, knobs I was telling you about. And they just, uh, they're studs that stick up and you stick it through the holes of the jack. And then I've got on the, I do have lock washers on the back side of this. Um, so this right here hopefully won't come undone. Then I've got my cable lock wrapped around twice and then just simply um, padlocked. And then here's my other one uh, here or my attachment point see if I can get you a little better angle what it looks like from the top view but uh, and there's what it looks like from the back side on that side over there but I got everything painted up to keep it uh, weather protected and so forth and I uh, think that's uh, I'm pretty pretty tickled with everything I really like it and uh, if you guys are looking for a inexpensive way to mount some equipment tools to the top of your uh, roof racks i think this right here would be a excellent project for you to do but anyway guys appreciate you tuning in as always like share and subscribe if you would so uh if you hadn't subscribed already subscribe to our channel you'll see uh, videos uh, similar content to this and you'll get notified and um 
uh, share our content with social media, Google, anybody you can share it with. That's always appreciated too. If you like our videos, give us the thumbs up. We appreciate those. That always tells us we're doing a good job for you. And as always, like, share, and subscribe. We'll be bringing another video shortly. Have a great day, guys.